got God, you've got God, I've got God, I've got God. We should be happier. We should be happier. We should be happier. I will go on to learn something, read something. You will go on to read something, learn something. Oh, you should be happy. Hi, just Yada here. Hope you are having a progressive year. I thank you sincerely for taking time to see this new video. In this video, I want to show you how to enable Internet Explorer mode on Microsoft Edge. Microsoft Edge is the replacement for Internet Explorer and today is very significant as Microsoft officially ended support for Internet Explorer after 27 years. And then Internet Explorer was most people's first idea of what a browser looks like and what a browser does. You can see how significant that is. To enable Internet Explorer on Microsoft Edge, you go to the settings to do that. And you need to do this because you may have some useful websites that only render on Internet Explorer. Thus, those old websites were built on old HTML, not the new HTML5. And those old useful websites may not even have CSS, not to talk of the latest CSS3. To keep visiting those websites, on Microsoft Edge, you need to enable Internet Explorer mode on Microsoft Edge. So let's do that. To enable Internet Explorer mode, you either go to the, you either click these three dots on the last part of where you have the download and share notification alert and all that. So the last three dots or on your keyboard, press Alt and F. This window will show up. Then go down to where you can see settings. Click it. It will be on profiles when you are on settings, but you need to select appearance. Then scroll down. You see. Then get to where it says Internet Explorer mode button. See, is grayed out. You can select it, but to to enable it, you need to select allow sites to be loaded in Internet Explorer mode. So select it. Click on this. It will open another window where it will. The option will be on default browser. Once there, the first thing you, the first option is let Internet Explorer open sites in Microsoft Edge. Click the question mark. And it will explain the options you have here which is never incompatible sites only always recommended so 
if you select never all sites that are based on old web languages will not be open on Microsoft Edge but when you select incompatible sites those sites that were built with old HTML and if it was styled at all if they if those sites were styled at all it will not be the CSS3 those ones will render well when you select incompatible sites only then this last one recommended if you choose this site sites will always open in microsoft edge instead of internet browser internet explorer so we will not pick that what we will pick here is incompatible sites only so that way any useful old site you visit will open on edge and render well here to we'll pick allow and we'll restart the browser so let's restart Now let's go back to appearance. Scroll down. Now we can watch this where you have share alerts and tips where the download button is. Watch what, what will happen there. See? the icon for internet explorer will, will show up there so any old site you visit with old web languages they will render well. i say to show you that in this video so it's your choice to enable this mode on your Microsoft Edge. Let me hear your feedback if you attempted and visited any of such old sites. Did they render well and all that? Please subscribe if you haven't. I will see you in another such helpful video. I thank you sincerely for your time.